Hi everyone, I am Lisa and now I'll show an unusual hand embroidery technique using the example of a simple leaf shape. Any thread or yarn is suitable for this craft. You will also need wire and double-sided tape. So in this technique you can make a decor of different sizes and shapes. You can make a flower, a heart, a bird or a snowflake with this technique. First we wrap the base of the craft with threads. So this is easy to do with tape. I will make the shape of the leaf later. Now I will form a leaf from the wire. So friends, if you want to make a flower, then it can be a petal. In this case, the middle part of the wire does not need to be added. So, when the base is ready, add air embroidery in the form of veins. I direct the stitches in different directions, clinging to the wire and edges and uh, stitches.
So friends, each stitch is important to fix with the knot on the wire. Now I hook the stitch and pull the thread in the other direction, like this. And fix. This is chaotic sewing. Guys, the thread as you like, uh, the embroidery will look like a skeletonized leaf. On this channel you will find many different tutorials using this embroidery technique. I made flowers using this technique without using wire. I also made a bird with this embroidery uh, using hot glue as a base. With this embroidery you can make a lot of different decor. So when you have enough stitches and you are ready, like the pattern, uh, fix the thread and cut.
Uh, you can decorate embroider with the rhinestones or sequins. You can also give the sheet a different shape. So you can make your own Christmas decor using this technique. 